look at what a nice day it is. I can't believe this is our garden, but we've got all of this as well. Good morning, excuse the hair. I've just had the nicest, loveliest shower. Where's Chip? Chip, are you in your room? Good morning, Chip. <laughs> Did you have a good sleep? He slept from 10 until 6, didn't you? And then we went out for a wee and a plate and then you went back to bed for an hour till 7. Yes. <laughs> It is such a beautiful day. Wow. Let's make Dad a drink. I think he wants a Diet Coke. What are you listening to? Sorry? What are you listening to? It's true when podcast. He's such an old man. No. <laughs> Lots of people that aren't old men listen to true crime podcasts. Okay. So I came upstairs to dry my hair and get ready. Well, thanks for that. <laughs> You're such a good boy. <laughs> if you've seen my Instagram, you'll know I was bribing him <laughs> with treats to come and sit on the bed. You're a good boy. Should we go for a walk? Or gum? So we're dressed and ready <laughs> it's a miracle it's a miracle and we're going to explore what's beyond our garden gate because yes. we couldn't really see it last night and it's it's amazing so we go through the garden through the gate and then we're just out into the wilderness which it's hardly the wilderness it is the wilderness i bet around that corner it's is the wild room. And we've lost the ball <laughs> in the it's nettles. There. The only bit that's not got nettles in it. Thank God there's not any in the middle of the nettles. Got it, got it, got it, got it. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. Woo. Good boy. Good boy. <laughs> See what I mean? I mean, I know you know, but like. <laughs> All those bluebells up there. Don't know how well you can see it right there. It's like an old front to this house. Is it like, it's like, like the secret garden door? Yeah. Don't want to freak you out, but this is kind of making me think of one of the towns in The Last of Us. The guy that showed us around said that this used to be an old mansion. Oh yeah. This must have been part of it. Maybe that's like a, right. Like a servants' quarters or something. Oh yeah. Yeah, like a portal. Like in Once Upon a Time. Yeah. Close to the Enchanted Forest. Oh. <laughs> I wish. Let's see if it works for me. Okay. I'm gonna go with the Mrs. Weasley method of just like giving it effort, so. <laughs> no. Look at Chip. <laughs> He's like, no chance. <laughs> I'm not going in there. <laughs> okay, let's go. Are you ready? <laughs> what 
Where'd it go? <laughs> <laughs> so close, but yet so far. Can't imagine what you would do if this was just your house. I know. Like, do you know what I mean? And you didn't, it wasn't like rented out and stuff. I think we'd have a Dalmatian plantation. <laughs> yeah, with probably. Labradors. <laughs> yeah, but Labradors instead. That was whenever I saw the live action 101 Dalmatians when I was younger and I saw that they had a Dalmatian plantation was that and, your dream? and babies and cups of tea and <laughs> a nanny. I was like, that's my that's dream. That's my dream life. That is my dream life. We can make it happen. Really? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> it's recorded, now you have to. <laughs> Let's point. go and have lunch. Let's go and have lunch. So we're now back from the walk. We're going to watch some Adam Hatton Disney vlogs, his new ones, and we're just going to make some lunch. We've got carrots that we're roasting. We've got a chicken pie. And the last thing is some potatoes. How exciting. So the sun's decided to make an appearance. So it's hot tub time! Whoop, whoop. Who's ready for a Q&A? Q&A. <laughs> Hello, I love you. Thank you so much to everyone that responded to our Instagram. You okay? Yeah, I just don't want him to drink my blue drink. Where's your blue drink? Right here. <laughs> it's probably not very good for him. Okay, I can't see. <laughs> I don't think either of us can. Um, question one. How are the wedding plans coming along? We're seeing a venue this week. Yeah, we are. I think though, for me, it feels closer than ever. Yeah. Like, we've been engaged for a long time, but now it feels like we're actually going to get married we're sometime on... soon. Excuse Chip. me. Chip. <laughs> we're on the cusp of booking it, aren't we? Yeah. And it's going to be um, a small wedding. Yeah. So I don't think it'll be. A, a massive amount of like, tons of planning and stuff no i don't think so okay question two is from amber louise smith and she asked are you planning to get married this year after disney no after dave finishes the tour and still go to disney no no <laughs> <laughs> so before dave got the tour we thought we were going to get married this year disney moved this year but because the tour finishes in october and we need to move back to london um, the plan right now is to move in October. Yeah, get when the tour finishes. When the tour finishes, get settled in our new house because that's going to be a big expense as well. Yeah. Um, but we're going to book our wedding hopefully really soon. Yeah. And hopefully everything wedding Disney Moon is going to happen like April, May yeah. next year. Because otherwise we were looking at maybe getting married when the tour finishes but then not being able to go to Disney until like next yeah. year anyway. And then it, it's all just a bit much. Yeah. So at least if we move in together we've then got about five or six months until yeah. the wedding and the Disney moon which I think will probably suit us yeah. a lot better. Yeah, yeah definitely. Kirsty Ann Johnson asked us What's your plans after Dave finishes the play that goes wrong? <laughs> a lot of these questions are the same. Yeah, similar. Uh, moving in together. Yay! Yay! <laughs> so yeah, um, we're looking at moving basically commutable to London. We're not yeah. sure where yet. We want this house in London. <laughs> yeah. I think it's achievable. I mean, a couple hundred quid a month rent, right? Yeah, with a big field and a lake on the back of yeah, it. Yeah, easy. We just need to move into Kensington Palace. <laughs> That's what it is, yeah. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, basically we're uh, we're going to move in together. Yeah. Again. Again. Okay, Happy Healthy Hebs asks, ha uh, I can't read. <laughs> now Dave has done the play that goes wrong, what would his next dream play or musical be? Ooh. It's, do you know, it's really hard to answer that question because... I've wanted to be in this for so long. Uh, the the guys that uh, mischief, who is the company that I'm now a part of, who who make the play that goes wrong, have another couple of plays. Um, Peter Pan goes wrong. Comedy about bank robbery. Those are really really good. Uh, I've always wanted to do Les Mis, um, just because it's such a great show. 
Okay, Molly can't cope. <laughs> Sorry, Molly. As <laughs> will you be vlogging the wedding and the honeymoon? Also, where is the best place to buy tickets for the play that goes wrong? Uh, well, I can answer the second part of that question very easily. Uh, you can go to the, the play that goes wrong dot com uh, and then just go to the UK tour sec. Well, unless you're going to go in London or wherever. Um, there'll, there'll be like a London section, a UK tour section, like a Broadway section and a US tour, I think, because that's going out as well. Uh, and just click on whichever one of those applies and then uh, I think it will redirect you to the I website. I can put the link your... to the UK tour one in the yeah. description box. And will you be vlogging the wedding and Disney Moon? Yes, I'll oh, be yeah. vlogging the wedding. I think what I'd like to do is have someone, even if it's not professional, have someone like filming lots for us, like of us. Yeah. Um, and then we'll film little bits like talking to the camera. Yeah. Cause... And then we'll just combine what they film along with what we film and will we be vlogging our Disney moon? The big question. <laughs> uh, yes. Ah, my phone! Basically, the, the long and the short of it is that yes, we will. Um, yeah. the, w we've been really torn about it because obviously we're only ever going to have one honeymoon. Um, yeah. Together at least. <laughs> <laughs> No, we're only ever going to have one... I considered marrying chips. We yeah, feel going on. Uh, yeah, like, so obviously, I think the difficult thing is that, like, we really want to be in the moment all the time and and enjoy our honeymoon. And it's not that vlogging would stop us doing that, but it does kind of take you out of the moment when you're stopping to make sure that the camera's, you know, like, in shot, yeah. and, and so you're in shot and you're in focus, and that, you know what I mean? Like, it's that thing of, like, and, and the thing is, we want to film it because we want to remember it, we want to have those videos and those memories for ourselves, but we also want to completely switch off. <laughs> just spat in my face. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. I love you. <laughs> so, what we are thinking of doing, is. <laughs> is filming everything in the first week so that will be seven full like 30 minute each maybe slightly longer if we want to yeah um disney vlogs and then we're going to take the second week off and the second week anyway is mainly just repeating what you've done in the first in the week, first week. Um, take the second week off but what we've decided to do is if we feel like it do instagram yeah stories yeah, in yeah, our yeah. second week so that we still get to film a little bit but it's a bit less pressure of like filming vlogs yeah last question is from ruthie hall and she asks um will you open a p.o box or create some merch merch we've never no. even thought about. yeah that's what i was literally <laughs> that's why i was taken so aback we've never thought about making merch i thought if we did we'd probably have something with flamley on it yeah that'd be cute but that's the only thing i've already thought about um pure box we're looking into it yeah potentially <laughs> um it would be really really handy when companies reach out and ask if they can send you stuff which of course like is a, such an amazing thing but I feel very uncomfortable giving up my mum's address. Would you like a PO box? Treats! Treats! <laughs> Treat box! <laughs> Actually, don't, don't get him treats. <laughs> he already gets way more, way more <laughs> treats than he's supposed to have. <laughs> anyway, it started to rain, so we are going to end the vlog here. But thank you for watching, and we will see you all in our next one. We love you. We love you, bye! Bye! Say bye, Chip. Oh. Mwah.